It's uh, very encouraging today uh, to see at Schofield Barracks everything they're doing to incorporate art therapy from the, the family to volunteer programs, outpatient. Um, we touched on music therapy and dance therapy, um, education. There were so many areas that we touched on today. I mean, this is a place that's really doing it right. This is a place that's really using art therapy to heal our soldiers and their families. Because art therapy is not arts and crafts, it's not even someone like me with a master's degree in art education, it's not something I could do. Alright, so this is my lovely shield. So art therapy is where you take these amazing professionals here who are therapists, uh, who understand uh, psychology and they understand how the mind works and they're using art as helping them with healing. And we actually see how working through art therapy actually does heal the brain. It's, it's astonishing. Art therapy saves lives. It can take someone who's contemplating suicide and turn them right around and flip it right over. It can take someone, I heard a soldier today say, you know, I was in a hole and this working with clay helped me come out of the hole. I'm completely healed. I'm not on any medications. And it just to see people tell these testimonies to me, to say it's actually saved my life is just a very powerful, powerful tool. This base uh, is, is doing everything. They're also working with the community, so I think that's a part of it that sometimes gets left out, is that uh, you can work with an art museum. They have a fabulous program working with the art museum. They can work with community leaders, uh, churches, and, and this base is doing that. So for my initiative, I have three pillars. Number one, I want to lift up the profession of art therapy. So you have people here at Schofield Barracks who actually are trained art therapists. Number two, I'd love for more people to go into the profession. We're never going to have enough art therapists. And third, my desire would just be for more and more of our military families, because it's not just the soldier, it's the entire family that serves, to know uh, there is help out there and art therapy might be the thing that, that you need to see.